Hello all, Havoc here. Let's get ready to play some Space Engineers on the Space Tinkerer server. Okay, so this episode we're going to be doing some logistical things. Um, I've been playing uh, here on the server here for most of the day. Um, started about, I don't know, three to four hours ago. And my goal was to try to get oxygen up and going on the station as best as possible. And so this is what I came up with. Uh, <laughs> it's a oxygen array with a little bit of solar in there to feel the the, the sun as well because it was some blank space that wasn't populating correctly. So, um, yeah. So we're gonna have one, two, three, four, five, six times one, two, three, four. So we'll have twenty-four. No. We're not going to have those two. So we'll have 22 oxygen generators piping into four oxygen tanks. I have a little oxygen uh, generator here on the back so I can get some O2 going. Um, so all these tanks are set to uh, stockpile. So anything these things generate is going to go into here and just get sucked up. So I've been working on this mainly uh, all day. I built it. This is the third time. The first time I built it up here. And I took down this tower because it's not really necessary. So I built it over here. And then when, uh, I realized that I had used small cargo containers by accident instead of conveyors. So it wasn't pumping the O2 around. And then uh, the second time I built it, I built it in the same spot. But then realized that in order to rotate it, the correct amount to get it to hit four bars into the sun, it was going to smash into this tower and this rock. So this is a uh, version three. So I uh, didn't bring you guys in on this because uh, it was literally just mind numbing hours of grinding parts off the station and bringing them up here and putting them in place. So scavenger hunt for large steel tubes and so on and so forth so what do you need steel plates and solar panels okay so um, what I like to do with you guys here today is um, tomorrow with Drake we're gonna be looking at moving the other station which is somewhere around here where is it there it is we're gonna be moving this and we're gonna go put it at uh, the zero coordinates so I kinda like to get some of the leg work done and out of the way so when we go to go do the move um, tomorrow, uh, this will be easy. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to build up a little pylon right here. And so we're going to put a merge block on that pylon. And then we'll bring the one of those large ships that we were just using to move the stations. Um, one of those guys right there. We're going to bring one of those up here and we're going to merge block onto here. And uh, we'll be able to move this thing tomorrow. So the big thing I want to do, which is I, I, I just think it would just be cool to do this, is I want to have the center of the base be at zero, so, or at least as close as I can get it to zero. So, so the advantage to this is is that uh, at any point in time, you want to find your way home, you just come into your GPS and you type in zero zero zero, show on HUD, that's home. So. That's kind of the premise of moving this to zero. And if memory serves, it is not that far. Zero, show on HUD. Where are you, zero? Zero. Where are you, zero? So 11,000 that way. That's really not that far. Um, we brought those two things over 45,000. Oh, by the way, that trip took me about an hour and 20 minutes to do. Um yeah pretty exhausting really wanted the parts <laughs> so um, what we're going to do is we're going to grab uh, actually let's go ahead and see if there's any components in there Yolk. so we're looking for some steel plates 
Don't need a lot. Just need some. Uh, Alright, so there's a large container somewhere on the station. And it's housing steel plates. Oh, hey, thank you. Was that lucky or was that lucky? Is that it? That was it. Oh, wow. Luck. Okay, so this is going to be temporary. Uh, this is not going to stick around. So we're just going to do this. Bring this up just a little bit above uh, everything here so we can do that. And then we'll throw a merge block on here. Do, 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 do. One thing is <laughs> with vanilla, man, this is awesome. It's, and I still can't find the merge block. What I was saying was is that uh, it's nice to be able to find stuff. And then I can't find it. Alright, so that goes here. I'm going to get this welded up. So more scavenger hunts. Um, construction components, motors, and small steel tubes. Uh, okay. So I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I'm um, getting more and more comments. Um, I am really enjoy the comments. You guys all know that. Uh, for those of you who watch the series, um, comments is what uh, does it for me. It makes me uh, happy and and joyful to know that you guys are enjoying it like you are and especially when I can't click on cargo containers m multiple times and hit the wrong button oh, hey we don't need you so here's some parts and do you have an ammo no you don't even have any ammo and if we can find one more of these I think this is all the components we need right here for merge block so how about you buddy do you have ammo? I bet you do because you're hooked up. Yep, you do. Alright. Okay. So, uh, yeah, with this series, we're just going to kind of... Um, I'm just playing to play. Um, there's no schedule for uploads, but uh, we're... Uh, just ha it so happens right now that I have the time that I'm able to do two videos, so I'm doing this in our standard uh, playthrough. So yeah, it's just the way it's working out right now. Um, I'm looking to probably do some more Seven Days to Die probably tomorrow, maybe Saturday. Um, I'm really loving that playing that game, and just right now with joining the server. This is what's uh, soaking up a lot of my time. That and with uh, also working. So. Do, 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 do. Okay, so. Well, that's that. So then what we'll do is uh, we're going to go throw. Actually, we'll save putting the other merge block on until tomorrow because we're going to do that when the other ship gets over here. So tomorrow when uh, we're on with Drake, we will. Uh, Get the other ship disconnected, and we will uh, bring it over and merge block it onto the station. And then the shenanigans will begin. We'll be hauling this all the way over to there, 10,000 meters away. 11 plus from where it's at. But uh, So we'll put a merge block down here somewhere, probably, I don't know, give or take, here. take the uh, center into account so we can get center of mass easier. If I was to guess, I'd say right about here. There. That's where we'll put it tomorrow. So, uh, let's see. What else are we working on today? Um, not a lot. There's, I mean, it's... Right now, I'm just... A lot of grinding. Um... One of the things I'm going to be working on here very soon oh, excuse me, 
is uh, disconnecting this module right here and taking it and parking it someplace on the station. I'm not sure where yet. That's why I hadn't done it. Um, I guess it'd be kind of cool to park it right off of this. What do you guys think? Coming out this way? I'm just go take a look inside that module real quick. Oh, and this one's got all the reactors in it too, so that's kind of cool. But it does not have gravity. So, yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to take this whole thing and we'll just dock it right off of that. Yep, that's what's going to happen. So... Okay, so I'm going to do that so I can do this. Merge block. And it'll be the incomplete one. This one. Power one. Okay, cool. But so finish that. That's good enough. <clears throat> so what I'm doing now is uh, we're going to label them so we can find them to turn them all off easier. Okay. Oh wait, I almost welded it back up like I was hacking it. Minerge. <clears throat> All right, so All right. Make sure. Got it. Last one. There it is. Guess it really doesn't matter at this point. We powered 300 billion. All right, so we're gonna weld that. And there's one thing left to dis to do that too. Is that's the connector underneath. Okay. Um, I did not check connectors before I ground that down, so I have no idea if there are any incomplete connectors. Whoops. Guess there is not. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and weld that up. Bam. Okay. So now we'll be able to uh, cut that free and this thing will hold drift, drift loose. So then we'll need a couple merge blocks over here. Uh, what do we got going down here for damage? Why are you here and put on your side? Oh. <laughs> uh, Havoc, wake up. On its side. Oh my goodness. There's no up in space, Havoc. Alright, so... 
go from here, we head out that direction. That's going to be kind of in the way this right here. I don't know about that. Let's see about looking on the other side. How far is it to get in the sun over here? Actually, we just put it right off of this panel right here. Like right here. Oh, it looks like we're a little low on energy there. Energy low. Why, yes it is. This is the overly obvious pointing out voice. Dunk. And there we go. That should make the uh, voice in the suit happy. And almost there, almost there, almost there. Bam. Okay. Inventory, how are we doing our auction? Ooh, none. Okay. So let's go grab some. Tank. So what I don't get is these things were getting power. They're pointed at the sun, but they're all red. They're all turned on. 92% efficiency, but they are not producing oxygen. I sat here and I watched my, I had one tank for a while. And um, actually, I'm going to try turning stockpile off and see if that helps. Actually, I can just hit that. Stockpile now turned off. So I just don't understand why those aren't working. Uh, they have power. Not only the solar panel is here, but there's also reactors down below with 300 uranium in them. Um, but uh, they're d not producing oxygen. So... Yeah, I, I... No idea. This is all complete. Everything is completed. And... It just doesn't work. I, I don't know. So... Like I said, I don't know. I'll let that go in the uh, non-stockpile mode and see if that uh, can, it adds to the stability of the system or not. So, I'll find out, I guess. And we're going to want to put this right here. Alright, so that's going to go there. And that's going to get replaced. I'll see if we can just put a merge block right on that. Nope. Okay, that's fair. Because it's not, well, it's not really a block, so. Okay. Um, actually, we can use this one. I think it'll look a little bit cooler. Alright, so then we're going to throw down some merge blocks. Which are on that toolbar already. Like that. Okay. Actually, we're not going to throw these down. that would be a waste of materials because we're just going to permanently attach it once, uh, oops, once we bring that over. So, once we bring that array over, it's going to get permanently attached. We'll just affix it with blocks and it'll all be good. So, next up we want to, um, I guess we're going to put a merge block on this thing anyway because, um, we're going to want to uh, move this thing with a merge block, so. Um, we're going to, in order to do that, we're going to take the antenna off, and I think we're going to put the merge block down here. I don't remember, is that how we did it on the, uh, on the Let's Play series? 
think it is. You go over there, so I don't accidentally put that someplace it's not supposed to go. I'm uh, keep the steel plates. Um, yeah, if I remember correctly, on the Let's Play series uh, on the on the channel, we uh, that's how we uh, we moved the this last time. Oh, large steel tubes. So need those. Oh, uh, love the grinding game. I think there could be a, a little meta game for grinding. No idea what it would be. I'd say swingling pendulum, but that's kind of overdone for mini games. And can we get this done this time? Okay, yes we can. Get rid of this. Alright. So we're gonna throw four on here. Wow, that is super bouncy, fun, 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 fun. Okay. Motors, large steel tubes, and computers. Motors, large steel tubes, and computers. Okay. Bam. All right. Done. So now we're going to well, we'll bring the ship over first. Uh, how do we want to dock this? Um, this is erroneous material. We're just going to kind of trim this off. This one we're going to take down entirely. And we'll replace it with a square block. We'll build up a little uh, nose on here, I guess. And then we'll just grind this off tomorrow when uh, we go to move the other part of the station. Or move the other station, I should say. So, come here. Oh, that looks pretty good there. Fabulous. Alright, so construction components, motors, and small steel tubes. Lots and lots of stuff. Oh, I think, you know what? That's stuff that these things should have in them. Construction components, large steel tubes, computers. This looks fantastic. Alright. Moving right along. Oh, missing the small steel tubage. Come on. You have small steel tubes? You don't, so of no use to me. You do, though. Alright, that's good enough. Bam, done. Okay. Actually, if I would have thought about it, I'm going to be cutting these three. Drifted out of range there. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Um, I mean, dang. Oh, hello. Oh, it's only one G of gravity. Come on. Uh, all right. Oh, don't need to kill that all the way. Just need to. Take it to that point. Alright, so that's all said and done there. Uh, no, it's not, is it? 
just realized that it doesn't like the fact that the blocks are counted as merged. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I forgot about the door shenanigans. I was about to get killed by my least favorite block in the game. What kind of fun would that have been? There's the painting tool tip again. Okay. And come on now. How did I miss that block? Oh, well, there we go. That's what we needed. Okay, we got power, that's all we need. Make sure it's got fuel. Alright. And we're off. This thing doesn't fly so much like a sofa when it doesn't have 12 million uh, kilos attached to it. Oh, I thought we were totally going to slide into that. We still could. Oh, no, 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 don't burn, don't, don't burn it. Oh, did I? No, okay, phew. I thought I was totally going to wreck that. <clears throat> Alright, so after our last move, this should be pretty straightforward. Alright, let's see what kind of range we got on that. Let's see if we can get a better camera angle than this. Ooh, that's a pretty good camera angle right there. Okay, so we can use inertia dampeners off so we don't cook our, that chip behind us. And it's probably going to be good to have inertial dampeners off when we connect these two anyway, so. I don't know if that's server lag or what. I'm afraid to move. Okay, that was weird. Okay, so let's try that one more time. And I think they're pretty dead on. Nope, oops, I got a little bit off there. Okay, I'm trying to get as many angles on this as I can to make sure we're as close to perfect as we can. Yeah, see, it's not, it's not connecting. It's trying now. All right. Yep. 
It's trying. Oh, it's not even close now. Come on, there you go. You got it right there, right there. When I turn initial dampeners off, it actually tends to make it worse. Okay, so what I'm going to do is this. this is, I'm, I'm probably going to die doing this. So, um, I'm just saying this now before it happens. I can be like, well, let's see. Like I said, I'm not, not just going to die doing this. Um, I'm surprised I didn't get torched right there. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't glitch into me. Um, I'm going to come down here and I'm going to disconnect. Uh, disconnect them. The, the power one. So... It'll be not towing the station around, is the idea. So it's going to K. Type in power. Connector, all you guys off. So in theory, This is its own module now. And this should not be so difficult. Keyword. Should not be. And we need to move this guy. And this is just... Ah, this is a really cool ship. We do not want to lose it. Um, if you guys had commented... Whoa! Gravity, wrong direction. Um, he guys had commented saying that this uh, looks like the Kestrel shuttle that should be the Kestrel shuttle. Like this is like the little sister, I think as you guys said, to the Kestrel. I totally agree. This does look like the Kestrel. Um, right, so we'll park this here. Our dampeners on. Yes, they are. It just looks like I'm generating a ton of lag for some reason. So, I'm going to go ahead and climb out of that. I think uh, those two, st that station pieces joining are what's causing the lag. Oh no. There it goes. Cleared up. Hopefully nothing catastrophic happened in order for that to get cleaned up okay you're still doing the shimmy shake okay I'm surprised I have not died yet Alright, so let's try this again. Inertial dampeners are off, but I'm just going to nudge my way over there. You know, if I have to bump the other piece off. Come on now, I just want this to work. <laughs> it was as simple as that, right? So it makes it seem like it is trying to still dock. Okay, there it goes. <gasps> oh no, what is going on? What is going on? Uh, that's not me. Oh wow, I have no idea what just happened right there. Uh it totally reminds me of when the Kestrel started sinking uh in our in our Let's Play series. Holy crap. Just 
just uncontrollable, just one direction that just doesn't make sense. Oh, wow. Oh, man. All right, we're going to reset up for approach. Wow, it just took off like just like a bolt of lightning. Just boom. Okay, let's try this one last time. Uh, this doesn't work. Uh, I'm not sure what to do. Um, all right. Okay. All right, so um, one of the big things I'm afraid of is just like straight up smashing into it. I don't want to do that either because then now that it's separated on the station side, there's nothing to stop the, uh, s the solar panels from just going off into the distance. So, okay, we're going to get up close again and uh, just do the final checks and balances to make sure everything looks good. That's closer than I wanted to get. No. Okay. Whew. All right. So I'm gonna do tip up. I'm gonna come down. I'm gonna back up a bit because I don't want to get too close where it starts doing the shimmy shake towards trying to join up again. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. We'll get it this time. We'll get it this time. Uh, if it doesn't get this, if we don't stick it this time, we're gonna have to call it uh, an episode and try to do it after the big move tomorrow. Um, oh, come on now! Come on now! Okay. That looks straight on from pretty much all angles. So here it goes, driving it in. I really don't think I can get much closer than that. I guess like it's bouncing out. That's nowhere near where we were at. So there's some sync synchronicity issues, desyncing issues. Oh, there it goes again. Look at that. Instant five uh, meters per second. to do um, I really want to get this module over to uh, our station but um, these shenanigans is really stopping this from happening Oh my goodness, Havoc. Oh, look at this. Ah, oh, Havoc. And now I've done an even more of a bonehead thing. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. 
think this might just get written off right now. Come on, man. Go, go, go. Let's see if I can uh, fix this derp. Oh, man. It would be bad if this thing moved like how you would anticipate it to, but it moves like it's like trying to move jello. It, it, it just. I want to put jello here, and it just doesn't really go there. It goes kind of where it wants to. I've got a lot of experience with moving jello. Not really. I'm just being sarcastic a little bit there. Okay, so did it stop moving? I can't tell. Um, it does not appear that it has. Oh man, this is, I'm running out of space. I'm running out of space. So all the space and I'm running out of it. Oh my goodness, this is so bad. Oh, yep, we're screwed. Right there. That just, that just did it in. Oh, wait, wait. Does he pull it off? Does he pull it off? Come on. Oh, come on. Yes, please. For all the cookies. Here it comes. Okay, which way do I have a feeling we're off on an axis or something? Get out of the way, HUD. Oh, come on. What's what? What are, what are you waiting for? Oh, now it's floating away. No, 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 no. Come back to me. There you go. There you go. Come on, come on, come on. That's the stick. That's the that's the stuff. Come on. What are our energy levels? Okay. All right, we got it. Oh, come on, come on, come on. We're so close. Oh, come on. Come on, you know you folks at home are like holding your breath just like me. You're like, come on, have it, get it, get it. It's like fishing. It's like bringing in that, landing that big fish. Boom, got it, nailed it. Yes. Whew. And that's it. We're going to wrap this episode up here. And I'd like to thank you all for showing up. And uh, holy crap. Oh. This episode's going about 20 minutes longer than I had planned. Um, but, yes, this was awesome. Oh, no, 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 no lag. Oh, no. Okay, I'll wait. Okay. Whew. Wow. All right, so now we'll just bring this over here, drop it off, and uh, we'll be good. <laughs> right? Right. So in retrospect, um, we should have used the other side for two reasons. One, the other side is not in the sun, currently on the station, and it would have made this side point into the sun. I guess oh, you can see the station was uh, floating. It's spinning. That's funny.
Okay, so am I going to be able to spin far enough to... Oh, whoa. Um, I'm slamming the station into the asteroid, aren't I? Yes, I was. That's fantastic havoc. Yay for death perception. Okay, so... <clears throat> Man, I cannot see that far. Okay, so enough energy and enough oxygen. That's good. We're just going to turn that off for now. Good back up just a touch so we don't slam into the rock anymore. We've already done enough damage to the nose of this. Um, so, I'm going to rotate the other way. <clears throat> so, my goal is to get uh, the other direction, Havoc. Uh, to get the bottom, that, that bottom tube lined up to be parallel with the deck of the station. So a little bit more. Like that. Give or take. There we go, it looks pretty good. So now the fun part is, is down is not down to where we're needing to go. We're gonna have to be using diagonal keys to get it to line up. And to add one more little niche to this, actually no, I would take that back. I was like, we're going to have to disconnect before we get close because the whole turn to station thing, but we'll just grind off that little beak that we put on the ship and uh, turn this back into a large ship. So I'm going to rotate a little bit this way. I was trying to like thread a needle with a fishing pole. And the thread is on the end of the fishing pole. <laughs> In retrospect, oh look at that, isn't that a cute view? Um, we would have put a uh, camera on the end here. So I'm going to try to find a view. Sorry for the glitchiness, guys. I'm just trying to find a view where I can actually see our distance. And we're nowhere near. So the last one I want to do is I don't want to nail it with the wrong merge block either, because that would that would be bad. Um, if I could do not just a touch more. Okay, so I need to go up. Man, because I'm, I'm rotated compared to the station. This is really being way more difficult than I was anticipating. So I have to kind of move on a diagonal in order to get it to uh, to line up how we're anticipating. Oh 
man, this is so difficult. Well, most a perfect view. Okay, so we need to back up. There we go. This is a perfect view. So I'm hitting the D key and space bar to wiggle this over. A glitch there for a second. I thought I was going to take it. It looks like I'm nowhere near it after all. Uh All right, so we're gonna get out and go take a look. Um, it's probably gonna snap to a station and kill me while I'm in route. I feel like I'm very close, so it's... Oh yeah, I am. Oh, look how close I am, guys. Oh, you know why? Because it's turned off. Power merge box. This is where I die right here. Turn on. Get out of the way, Havoc. No? No? Okay. It's trying. It's trying very, very, very hard. You know what? I bet you if we did this. Uh, no, 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 we're not going to do that. We're going to get it to sync up properly, and I was going to cut that block loose, and in theory it would have snapped into place, but um, we're not going to do that. Because then it could, in theory, go flinging off into space uncontrollably, and I would have to end on a very sad note, and I don't want to do that. It wants to dock. You can just like see it. It's like it pulls it in and then. No, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't bring, don't make me come all this way for uh, this much disappointment. Come on, come on, please, just... Make it work. Make it a thing, just merge. Nope, destroyed it. <sighs> okay, so... I'm gonna have to wrap it here. Um, this was lots of fun. <laughs> Very stressful, I think... Uh, I just shaved like two years off my life with the stress on that. But um, no, it was fun. We've learned some things. What to do, what not to do. Um, when I uh, play next will be tomorrow with... Uh, oh, wow, look at all the damage it caused. Oh, man. When I, we play tomorrow with uh, Drake, uh, we will... Uh, We'll see about getting this fixed and uh, working proper. So um, this is Havoc. Uh, have fun and don't trash your stuff like this so you can uh, be sure to keep gaming.